So this is how I start my day, sharing some really simple ideas to get the day off to a really good start. So new day, new week, new year, let's just do it. So when I wake up, big stretch, oh, just kind of take a few minutes to settle into the day and use this time to think of good intentions for the day, affirmations, bit of contemplation, bit of quiet time, bit of meditation, bit of mindfulness, whatever you want to call it. So it is literally just taking a few minutes, maybe five minutes, 10 minutes, whatever you have, just to be quiet, just to focus on your breathing, on the things that are going to happen today, the good things, letting some space be around you so that you can let good stuff come into your life and the day ahead. So it's just about really clearing your mind and just almost rinsing your brain. I always have this image of my brain kind of being under the shower and just cleaned and fresh and revitalized and recharged for the day. Now, obviously, if you've got a program that you follow, you can be doing out, there are lots of different apps. There's apps like Calm, there's the 42 Days, there's so many different ones that you can find online that you can follow. Or you can just sit really quietly, maybe with some calm music on for five or 10 minutes. And actually, I use this time personally to have my LED mask. So one of Lily's masks from Cell Return. So I either wear that while I'm doing a bit of breathing or meditation, or maybe just the neck or ray. I'll just put that on and literally just take 10 minutes of quality time to focus the mind. So the next thing that I do, first thing in the bathroom is think about rehydrating because we've been asleep, dehydrating overnight. So water, mm, got to be first thing. Then, before I clean my teeth, a little Ayurvedic trick, copper tongue scraper. Uh, you scrape your tongue just a few times, uh -huh, just to get rid of the build up of the bad stuff overnight. A bit more water. Mm. Rinse it out. And then I take supplements on an empty stomach, the ones that need to be on an empty stomach. So for example, if I'm doing a bit of high intensity exercise, I'll have my amino slim. So I'll take five of these, or maybe a teaspoon of the powder in some water, because that has to be on a completely empty stomach. It doesn't want to have any sugars or proteins or fats or anything like that. But the one thing that you can take with it is NMN. So that is the powder that just gives you a bit of a lift. I love it in the morning, really good. And it comes with a little scoop. Those of you that haven't tried it before, it's just opening a new packet here. So one little scoop under the tongue. Mm. Oh, fizzy, slightly sour. And then um, I might also take my Ingenious Beauty Collagen. So again, that needs to be ideally on an empty stomach. It's not as particular, you know, the Amino Slim is really fussy as a supplement, absolutely must be taken away from food. Um, but the, the Ingenious Beauty, not so much. I take that maybe after I've done a bit of exercise or maybe if I'm not having the Amino Slim, then the Ingenious Beauty. So that's the one that I use. I buy it like this in the refill packs. And I take between three or four of these, first thing. Hmm. So that, is my early bathroom routine. So the next thing is a bit of movement, a bit of exercise, great way to start the day, get the blood circulation going. It doesn't really matter what you do, you can jump around and give yourself a good shake. You can do some really, oh, lovely stretches. Get outside if you can, go for a walk, go for a run. If time is really tight, what I do is I'm literally back here in my bedroom, just for a few minutes, weights, are a girl's best friend. These are quite light, these are three kilos. So you can start with something like this, you know, you can do your hammer curls, you can do your weighted squats. So you're just going to sit down like that. Always keep your core tight. Lots more on YouTube that I've recorded with Michael Gary, because he's the expert, not me, but we've filmed various things that he makes me do, which has really helped over the years. So the weights that I've got in my 
armory if you like these are six kilos and these are the ones that i use for hammer curls and these are exercises for the arms that michael makes me do at least three times a week whenever i see him he says right hammer curls so i do two sets of 25 of these and then i've been working up gradually with the weights for the squats the weighted squats and i've now got my new kettlebells these are 18 kilos each so they're quite heavy um, and this is really whoops this is the only exercise that i do with them weighted squats because they're too heavy for me to do anything else with but keeping my shoulders back and my core tight is weighted squats okay so what you really want to do is you're putting the body under a little bit of pressure really good as we age because you're helping to increase muscle mass bone density all of that there's all sorts of interesting research about longevity and lifting weights pushing yourself for kind of 30 seconds so i do maybe 20 25 of those maybe two sets but you can work up you know literally your first weights can be really light it's about progress not perfection from the beginning progress and of course the other great thing that you can have which is useful for traveling it's great to have in your bedroom is a resistance band and these are fantastic for all kinds of stretches so much online look up on youtube you'll find lots of exercise moves and classes and routines using resistance bands really safe and you just use your own body weight and a bit of resistance there you go so i think as many of you know i don't tend to do breakfast but i do like to make a great green shake and this is something that i'll have maybe mid-morning might have it with some extra vitamins depending on what i'm doing that day and I use different types of green powders, a bit of kefir, a bit of protein powder, lots of good things. And there is a link actually on YouTube and also on Lizard Wellbeing to lots of great green shake recipes. They are so delicious and so nutritious. Mm. Great way to fuel up. <laughs> so those are just a few little tips to get you started off for a great day. Have a good one.